Hi everyone, Jason from Makera here with another Carvera how-to. And in this one, we're looking at how to replace our spindle collets in our desktop CNC's. The collet is the part of the spindle which holds our bits during machining and releases them during tool changes. You might consider changing the collet to be able to use larger or smaller cutting tools with your CNC or to replace a malfunctioning spindle collet. The Carvera is shipped with a 3.175 millimeter or eighth inch collet by default, but it can be equipped with collets ranging from three millimeter to 6.35 millimeter sizes, which includes the standard US size bits of eighth inch to quarter inch. The automatic tool changer can also hold bits across this range and the wireless probe shank can be adjusted for this range as well. Now replacing your collets is pretty easy to do using the collet removal tool that comes with every Carvera CNC. First, you should drop any tool that is loaded in your spindle using the Carvera controller app. We then wanna remove the dust shoe and the hose pipe so we have easy access to the spindle and its collet. Carefully insert and align the collet removal tool with the spindle collet and then rotate it anti-clockwise to loosen the collet out of the spindle. After the collet is loose, you should be able to finish unscrewing it by hand and be prepared for it to drop out from the spindle. We can then carefully insert a new collet in the same way, first by aligning the collet and threading it in by hand while turning it clockwise. Once hand tightened, you can use the collet removal tool to snug the collet into the spindle, but there is no need to apply excessive force or use a larger wrench. Now, of course, after installing your new collet, you're gonna to wanna to work with new bits as well. The bit collar installation tool that comes with the Carvera is compatible with the same bit range as the spindle collets, and collars for each size bit can be found in our store. After installing bit collars, you can load your larger bits into the Carvera's automatic tool changer as you would normally. You also need to replace the shank that's on the wireless probe to match the size collet that you've installed or else the probe will not be able to be picked up during a tool change. Lastly, it's important that you adjust your tool library in your CAM software to correspond with your new bits. And remember that optimal speed and feed parameters will change when using larger or smaller cutting tools. And something else you might want to consider are bit adapters. These adapters will allow you to use different size bit shank diameters with different collets by increasing the shank diameter of smaller bits so they can be selected with a larger bit collet that is in use. This allows you to use a wide range of bits from small shank diameters to large shank diameters within a single project, which can be really handy if you already have a large collection of one size bits or if you want to be able to use a much wider range of bit sizes and types for more versatile CNC production. Check out our store for all the accessories shown in this video. And of course, please don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching.